and welcome to Talk of the Town. My name is Natasha Ashka and I know you're probably thinking, where has she been? But I've come back with a bang. And I have to say, I'm delighted to be having an interview today with someone who has really, really taken the music industry by storm. She is conquering the Asian, uh, Asian scene as well as the mainstream. I'm thrilled to be sitting with the one, the only, Tara Priya. Welcome to the show. How are you today? I'm doing great. So Tara, tell me, how did you become involved in the music industry? Um, I, I left uh, New York, I left school, and um, I went back to San Francisco, mm -hmm. and I connected with a guitarist there who we had mutual friends, and um, we started writing together a lot, you know, um, I'd written some things on my own, and I didn't feel super comfortable with them, and mm -hmm. I worked with him, and he, um, even though he was really young, he had also grown up on all this blues and old soul and all these old records and so we had the same influences and we really collaborated really well and wrote most of the songs together for my EP. Fantastic. If you could collaborate with anyone, who would you love to work with in future? Ooh, that's a tricky one. In terms of producers or songwriters? Cause Whatever you prefer. Um, for songwriters, I'd, I'd really love to work with Glenn Ballard. Mm -hmm. He's just an amazing writer and um, I think he's really talented and has been working, you know, he did Michael Jackson, Christina Aguilera, he can work with anyone. Um, and then in terms of production, mm -hmm. I'm really interested in working with, um, I don't know, people like, you know, Paul Epworth and um, Dan Wilson and people who um, have been around for a while and are also still working today and mm -hmm. I just anyone who's really interested in um, soul and that kind of thing quest love does amazing things with artists Tara I've done my homework on you and I have to say you are very educated you went to Columbia University and you actually finished it in two and a half years compared to the normal duration of any form of degree that's out there. Mm. How important is education to you having, you know, also whilst having a singing career as well? Yeah, um, well, I think education is of utmost importance. Um, I really believe in its, in its power, whether um, to change an entire country mm -hmm. or, you know, to change um, a single human being. Um, I think that if you are educated, in no matter what field that you're in, um, you'll you'll rise to the top if you, if you continue to go about it in a smart way. I don't at all regret going to school. Mm -hmm. I'm really glad that I did, and I, I wish that everybody would try and master their craft. Um, in addition to also being, you know, an intellectually curious mm -hmm. person in in the world. How did you juggle your music as well as your uh, education at the same time? It must well, have been difficult. It was it was really difficult, but at the same time, my music education was part of um, my studies at at Columbia. So I was majoring in, in economics, but at the same time, I was taking music classes and training, and I got some credit for that too. So that made it a lot easier. It, to mix business and pleasure together. Yeah. That's fantastic. Now, I've heard Roland, and I have to say, I loved it. You are truly a soulstress. Thank you. Extraordinaire. I love the track, love the video even more. How can my uh, viewers get in touch with you, find out more about what you're going to be getting up to? Oh, um, they can follow me on Twitter, mm -hmm. which is just at Tara Priya. Okay. Um, they could visit me on Facebook. Mm -hmm. I update that all the time about where I'm going to be and what I'm working on. Mm -hmm. um, and that's just facebook.com slash Tara Priya Music. Um, and then there's good old Google. You Brilliant. can always just do that. So what have we got planned for you? Now, we're in, well, we're at the end of 2011. What is 2012 bringing for Tara Priya? What are you going to be showing us? Um, I've got my um, another EP coming. Uh, we've got, in a couple of weeks, uh, releasing the second single off the first EP. Mm -hmm. Um, and that'll be really exciting. I've got another music video coming out. Um, I'm going to be on tour, especially in Japan for a lot of February. Wow. So yeah, I'm really excited about Fantastic. that. Fantastic. Now we are indeed Bollywood for you. Okay. Mm -hmm. And uh, I've heard the track rolling, but the viewers at home probably haven't or may not have. If they haven't, would you mind stringing a few lines for us? Totally. Yeah. We'll Fantastic. do like a verse and a chorus. So we have our lovely, delightful guitarist, Jacob. He's going to take it away. Go for it, Jacob. Sometimes, when the world is bringing you down, down to your very knees, maybe you'll think, well, maybe, just maybe. Maybe my heart won't make the distance. Maybe my heart won't see it through. I wasn't meant to run a marathon. A 30-second sprint I'm through. I wonder if I 
smash it up and quit When I'm rolling, rolling, rolling My heart around the bend That I'm rolling, rolling, rolling Life's kicking me down again Tara, that was absolutely fantastic. Brilliant. Loved the performance just then. But I need to ask you, you've done so much. What's been your greatest achievement so far? I mean, really just being able to get to the point where I can sit here and talk to you. Like, I mean, I was just in India. I, two days ago, I came back from India and um, I played the NH7, the Bacardi NH7 Weekender, which right. was in... Uh, which was in Pune, um, and just being able to do that, to be in Pune and Mumbai and go to those places for music, to perform my music mm -hmm. and have people really respond to it was like a dream come true. And now, and now I'm here and getting all these opportunities and it's just all I ever dreamed of. So. Oh, fantastic. So if you could collaborate with absolutely anyone out there, we've got people like Beyonce, you've got people like Raghav, Jay Sean, so many people in the industry, who would you love to collaborate with? If you could have your you know, pick of the creme de la creme. Well, in terms of performance artists, like writers and composers, Ea Rahman is very, like, amazing, cream of the crop, like you said. But um, in terms of performance artists, I would love to collaborate with um, Rafael Sadiq, mm -hmm. who's another retro soul artist, or um, Mayor Hawthorne. He's also really awesome. And they're both out of L.A., actually. Um, or Kanye West, because um, he's you know, hilarious, and he's also a brilliant producer and songwriter and rapper. He's such a great rapper. I've he's, always admired He's him. a pretty good showman. Fantastic. Well, guys and girls, we are going to head off to a couple of, oh, well, a couple of short, eensy weensy teeny wee little messages, as also known as the ad break. When I come back, we will not only be meeting a very, very special guest who's here especially for a, I should say, a pre-New Year shindig here at the B4U studios. We will indeed be meeting him very, very soon. So don't go anywhere. We'll see you right back here after these short messages. Welcome back everyone. You are indeed with myself, Natasha Ashgar, on Talk of the Town. Now I did say to you before we went to those short messages that I was going to have a very special guest in the studio, aside from the gorgeous Tara Priya and Jacob, I have the one, the only Raghav. Welcome. Very well, thank you. Welcome to the show. It's been a while. It's been a long time. You make, you make it sound like it. it's been a while. It has been a while. Like I've been on a castaway island. Feels like it, dude. It's been great to see you. How has 2011 been for you and what have you got in store for us for 2012? Um, it's actually looking like a really promising year. I'm doing some Bollywood work. I was out in Bombay working on some big films. Mm -hmm. So uh, hopefully they all come to fruition in, in uh, 2012. How would I say, how do you say that? 212? How do you abbreviate 2012. that? 2012. 2012. Isn't that right, Tara? 2012. Okay, so like in 2012. <laughs> um, we have some big Bollywood projects, and then I've been in Canada, so I haven't been completely AWOL. Mm -hmm. So I put out a record called Fire, which just went gold in Canada. Fantastic, congratulations. And we've just put out a record called Top of the World, which I know they've been playing on B for You. Mm -hmm. And uh, yeah, so there's a lot going on. Fantastic. And obviously you met, you must have met uh, Tara Priya. She has definitely, nice be, she's been giving nice us Nice to a meet you again. <laughs> we've been doing a media junket together. Oh, I gotta brilliant. Tell you, she's fabulous, and I'm a big fan. Mm -hmm. And I'm a big fan of her record, the one called Rolling. Yep. It's all I've heard. I'm a big <laughs> fan. And in the cab ride on the way over here, mm -hmm. we were planning. Well, I don't think she was planning. She was like, whatever. <laughs> I was trying to plan the rest of her career out for her. Oh, that's Using so sweet. Using whatever small amounts of wisdom I've garnered throughout the years. I really, oh, that's really think sweet. she has... He basically told me that my career was over unless I worked with him. So. Oh, now, well, there now you what go. can that's I not do? True. No, I know. I never said that. There you go. Potential future something. collaboration right here on B for You. Fantastic. So, guys, now I've got you with me on the hot seat, okay? We're going to be playing a little game. I play this for Makit Singh, Jay Shaw, numerous other artists. I'm hoping to play it with you guys as well, okay? It's called the firing round. I know it sounds violent, but it's not. It's going to be as nice and as sweet as possible. I'm going to ask you some questions, okay? Tend to be precise. For example, I'm going to say favorite color. And the first Red. 
That's like, that's it. You got the, you got the. Gist. He already knows. There yeah. you go. So that's basically <laughs> the sort of flow that we're going to be taking. So no time to think between questions and answers, and we're just going to go for it. So we're hopefully going to. Start, is, is that okay if we start with you, Tara? Yeah, absolutely. Okay, fine. Let's go for it. Favorite food? Oh, uh, a simple yellow dal and our nice roti. Fantastic. Favorite place in the world? Ooh, Cape Town, South Africa. Fantastic. Ooh. Favorite holiday destination? H home. Which is home? Oh, like San, <laughs> like my with my dad in San Francisco Bay Area. That's really sweet. Okay, favorite Bollywood film? Um, Kohona Piare. Favorite Bollywood actor? Uh, Amir Khan. Okay. Favorite song? All time song? Really anything by Stevie Wonder, but um, Stevie Wonder for once in my life. Oh, Great lovely. song. What a choice. Amazing. Very Great good choice. choice. And I have to say, favorite dance track? What really gets you kind of going? Oh, uh, Lady Gaga, Just Dance, or Kesha, TikTok. Very nice, cool, I like it, I like it. Okay, also want to ask you, favorite celebrity, who do you kind of keep an eye on the most? Is there anyone who you kind of really oh. kind of search for in the tabloids? No. Not at all? Oh, I guess I could pull one up if I had to. Don't worry, honey. We'll pass this, this question. We'll go on to a quick, another okay. quick fire round. That's nine, nine, nine you've got down so far, just for the tenth one. We've been really, really well so far. Ooh, London. What about London? What do you associate with London? Oh, right now, Christmas. Oh, fantastic. Well colors. done. That's a really lovely answer, actually. <laughs> yeah. I'm really impressed by that one. Fantastic. Thank you so much for that, Tara. Raga, moving on to you now, okay? Some of your questions may be similar. Some of them may be different. I hope you're ready and good, good to go, okay? Right. Red. Not favorite colors. I'm not going to ask you that. Just practicing at all. Okay. Favorite holiday destination. Bombay. Favorite actor. Meeta Bachchan. Favorite Bollywood film. Shakti, the old one, not the new crap one. Favorite track of yourself. Track of myself. Your own track. Yeah. Okay. Bad, bad, bad. Okay. Fantastic. Ooh. Favorite food. Sushi. Okay, strange choice, but nonetheless, okay. What's strange about the sushi? Now you made me feel awkward. No, no, it's fine. I would have expected you to be like world. biryani or something like burgers, a bit of a. Well, I'm saying I'm fat. A bit of a man food. You're I would have. Look I, bad. I, no, no, I, I would have said being a man, you'd have said biryani or like burgers or steak. Well, I guess I'm a woman because I like sushi. <laughs> He's like diet. What's pie. going on? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, the women are in force today. Okay, cool. All sushi. Right. Favorite artist out there, male or female, could be absolutely anyone. Of all time? Of all time. Michael Jackson. Favorite song of all time? Billie Jean. Favorite outfit? Favorite outfit? <laughs> yep. Like that I would wear? That you would wear. Uh, you know, I'm a kurta pajama guy. Oh, dream girl. Last question. Uh, just any woman that could uh, sew me a kurta pajama and spice up some sushi. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for that, guys. <laughs> I have to say, I've never had such an entertaining lightning round with both with two people before. Very, very interesting. Red. We're, we're done. Still practicing. Going. We're still going on the red flex here, yeah, no problem. But as it is indeed New Year's on the, you know, it's on the horizon. I was wondering if we could hear a special something, something from you guys, especially for the viewers at home. Oh, sure. Yeah, we'll do um, another part of. Um, what I think will be my next single, which is Wounded. And then we can also have a couple of lines from Ragov as well. Oh, yeah. okay. this, is, this is like a Tara Priya Christmas special. I know. <laughs> I feel like there should be a fireplace and some reindeer it and should some elves. Be. It should be, definitely. But we're having... be for you Christmas special. That's Are it. you sure you don't want him to go first ladies first, right? Oh. Oh, because I like sushi? <laughs> don't forget the red. The red. Yeah, yeah. Red. For love. I was going to say my ideal woman is someone who likes simple dal roti and whose favorite color is blue. <laughs> oh, bless you. Red. Like yep, it? you're good to go.
So now it's Raghav's turn. I'll sing you any song you want as a Christmas gift. Oh. Will you come to my doorstep and sing it though? Hello. <laughs> <laughs> no, as a Christmas unless, unless your dad answers. No, that's fine. He's cool. I'd listen, if I had a nickel for every time a girl said, <laughs> my dad's cool, and then when stuff goes pear-shaped, she's like, I mean, my dad should come talk no, to you. No, do you know which song I really love of yours? I love Hamrahi. Okay, sure. So let's have a bit of Hamrahi. Itna samjho Hamrahi Bin tere mere saathi Kyon sunne har vaadi Aisa hai khumar Tere mere pyaar ka Khilta hai chaman Mausme bahar ka Aisa hai alam Ho mere metwa Ab roke na roke ga Kuch tera na mera hai Pal se chura le Jeevan behta paani ये लम्हा ही है अपना बना ले बाकी सब है फानी हो दिल की धड़कन ने है पुकारा तुझे ही हम रही हो wow that actually blew me away I have to say guys thank you so so much to um, for coming on the show it was an absolute pleasure to have you Few last words to my uh, viewers at home. New Year's resolutions for Red. 2012. Okay, easy tiger, easy tiger. Resolutions for 2012 for you guys. We know you have a great year ahead for both of you, okay? I know you're gonna go far and all of our wishes and prayers are with, with both of you, especially in going forward in your careers. But what's your resolution for 2012? I wanna call my family more um, wherever they are in India, Iran, my dad in the Bay Area, which I don't have an excuse to not call, <laughs> but I, I want to be in touch, better in touch. Spending time with family. What about yourself, Raghav? Well, I mean, it's not really a resolution, mm -hmm. but I think I've been so busy at work, I haven't made time for, I haven't made the right amount of time for a relationship. So I think mm -hmm. now um, I need to travel a little bit less. I'm gonna get a girlfriend this year. I'm looking for a wifey, I think. Ooh. I'm on a wifey hunt. Fantastic. Well, let's help you out here at BFU. What are your credentials? I need someone smart. Mm -hmm. That's all I need. She's just got to be smart. She doesn't need to be able to get into the kitchen and make you spicy sushi. Babe. Absolutely not. She's just got to be smart and funny. What That's... about your kurta pajamas? Kur yeah, she needs to be Who's able to stop your kurta pajamas them? as well. What happened to those? Listen, I go to India all the time. I'll spend the 150 <laughs> You heard it here, right? Okay, guys and girls, he doesn't want a world girl to cook, just be smart, yeah? Actually, actually that's absolutely true. Really? Yeah, I'd much prefer to spend time. Fantastic. Yeah, that's, that's true. So where can girls get in touch for the, the rug of marriage sort of Twitter.com <laughs> forward slash rug of worldwide. <laughs> Facebook.com uh, forward slash rug of worldwide. Mm -hmm. Info at rug of.com. Info at b4u.com. Or you can call me on 07... <laughs> Okay, let enough Sigh. for that. Enough of that one, guys. But thank Sigh. you, so, thank you so so much to each and every single one of you for coming on the show. It was an absolute thank pleasure you. to meet you. And sincerely, from the bottom of my heart, and also for the viewers, we do wish you all the very very best. She's going to be a star. Definitely. She's going to be a star. Definitely, you're all going to do really well. So thank you so much, guys and girls. And I hope you have a fantastic New Year. You thank too. you too. Thank you. Well, guys and girls, I hope you enjoyed today's episode. We've now come to the end of Talk of the Town. I hope you had a fantastic time and enjoyed having a very uh, intimate interview with Tara Priya as well as our very special guest, Raghav. I hope you have a fantastic new year. Whatever you're doing, be good, be safe. And, it's, and I'm going to be signing off for the end of 2011. Lots of love from Natasha Ashkal and the rest of the B4U team. <laughs>